Hey, welcome to News You Can Use. I'm your host, Brandon Gomez. Listen, if you're from Toronto, then I would bet $100 you have had a patty, right? And if you haven't, then you need to go find your life and go try one, okay? Because especially today, today is Jamaican Patty Day in Canada's largest city. Now, before I share any more details, I do need you to do a few things, like subscribing to this channel, tapping that notification bell, and make sure to follow us on all of our social media. The details are in the description below. So we all know Jamaican patties come from Jamaica, but did you know there are a few major players in the country that produce the delicious treat, including Tasty. We're actually gonna be speaking with an executive from the company to get the low down, or the high down, on the patty that has taken the world by storm. Let's bring her in. Carol Hill, head of retail and operations at Tasty Patties, joining us all the way from Jamaica. How are ya? I'm fine, thank you. I'm so excited that we're talking today because I know it's a very special day. It's Jamaica Patty Day here in Toronto. And you know, there is a large contingent of Jamaicans in this city, and you guys make some of the best patties in the world. <laughs> we are the tastiest. As you know, I'm Jamaican as well, and when I would visit the island, especially when I was younger, we would always have tasty patties. But I always wanted to know, what is the history behind Tasty? Tasty began in 1966, and it was born of a dream of five trillion immigrants. Mr. Vincent Chan came from Hong Kong. He came to Jamaica. He worked in Hannah Town Bakery and he realized that he had a knack for making, for baking stuff. He then, when he got married in 1966, he and his wife decided that they would start their own business. And they started on the side, not the main product, to make this flaky pastry with meat inside. It was his vision to give the poor man something nutritious to eat. He noticed that his line got longer and longer. So he said, oh, I'm onto something. And he would bake and he would test it on his customers. And they said, everything that he baked, whether or how he tweaked it or not, they said it was tasty. That is how he came up with the name Tasty. And they combined their island cuisine, the island spices, and they brought their own secret savory spices to the meat and put it in their patty and it's the flakiest pastry that you have around us. You know, there are different patty makers out there and there's always this rivalry, which is the best, which is the best, which is the best. What makes Tasty so special in your opinion? Nobody has the crusty, flaky crust that we have because that's the skill of our baker hot, savory meat and crust in the tastiest crust you can find. That's amazing. So how big is Tasty now? Like how big is Tasty Patties now? We have covered coverage of 47 locations, but that is not only our stores. We have 18 locations that we centrally run. We have four schools that we run their canteens. We have one university. Then we have 16 distributors and eight franchises. So that's how we've grown to 43 stores across the length and breadth of Jamaica. That is so wild. Like who would know that literally this simple, simple, uh, I call it, I don't know, pastry. It can be a meal sometimes when you put it with the cocoa bread. You know what I'm talking about? Yes. It can be so economically <laughs> enormous. You know what I have to ask you? Because you're there, you know, at ground zero of Tasty Patties. How many patties do you eat? Have you seen my size? You see my size? But you look good! Well, thank you, thank you. But this is the result of eating all of these patties. <laughs> you know, I have other flavors. Because I have curry chicken, I have jerk chicken, and we have vegetable. I'm so excited that you shared that because generally when people think of patties, they think that it's just beef and that's the only way to have them. But there's so many different ways. So many different ways. And our, our Jamaican people get inventive. They ask for curry chicken with cheese mm -hmm. and they combine it with the cocoa bread. Um, patty, patty is a go-to. It's a staple in Jamaica. It's something that everybody stores in their fridge if you're in Jamaica. But you're coming home to buy it to bring back to eat overseas. 
You know, Kara, I wanted to ask you, I know ackee and sawfish is clearly the national dish of Jamaica. Yes. But do you think the prime minister and maybe the government there would potentially ever change it to patties? I don't think they'll go there. <laughs> <laughs> but we, we are definitely, if you are to Jamaica, want to carry back or what you want to eat, it's tasty patties. Awesome. Carol Hill from Tasty Patties, thank you so much for joining us on News You Can Use and happy Jamaican Patty Day. Same to you. Hey BG Squad, thanks so much for checking out our channel and listen to this, we have more great content for you like this video right here and this video right here. By the way, don't forget to subscribe to this channel right now and tap that notification bell.